You can barely even see it, but it's the first snowfall of the year, so you know what that means. The holidays are almost upon us, and if you're looking for the perfect gift for your boyfriend or girlfriend for Christmas or anniversary, birthday, or just for a random occasion, Open Ones are the perfect gift to give them. So here's 30 plus Open One ideas I have for you. I started making these letters around a year ago for my boyfriend for our first anniversary and he loved them. These letters are fun to make and be creative with. They're honestly really easy to make and they're a great way to look back on your relationship for years to come. Before starting your open ones, I suggest trying to find some sort of box. I found just this box at some sort of craft store. Um, all I did was write open one here and then I wound up painting the top of it because it was some sort of like tropical leaf pattern. So I just painted it black. To make your open one letters, you're also going to need some envelopes. These are just from Amazon. They're honestly super cheap. Um, it came with an arrangement of colors. There's a whole bunch of them. I'll link it in the description below. These are honestly just perfect for your open one letters and I highly recommend them. Some additional things you'll need to make your open one letters are going to be things like pens, um, stencils, stickers, note cards, anything you're going to want to design it or personalize it to be your own. Even if you aren't the most creative, don't worry about messing up. You'll always be able to fix it. And honestly, if you make a mess up, you can just roll with it. You can make it into something else. You can cover over it. You can work with it. So the first letter I have is kind of just an open first letter. And I have um, open on January 25th, 2022 on our one year anniversary, because that is the day that we started dating. So I just have this. And then inside of it, I have a rules card. And this I kind of think is just a fun little idea to add in. Um, I looked off of Pinterest for some of these ideas and this was one thing that I found and I really loved it and thought it was hilarious. So I decided to add it to mine. You don't have to, of course, you can do whatever you want with your open wind letters, but I highly suggest this because I think it's really funny. With this, I also just included a cute little letter for our one year anniversary. The next one I have is open when you want to take a trip down memory lane and in this one I just included some little note cards. On the note cards I just have just some of our memories. I have the date up at the top and then I just have a little description of what we did that day. Like I have us going to the movies, um, when we went on a double date, when we went to different parks and stuff like that. For the next one I really enjoy just writing my boyfriend little notes or just random little letters so I wound up just giving him a plain envelope just for when he wants to read past letters. It's just a place for him to put old letters if he wants to read them. The next one I have is when you're thinking about our future and this one I actually have quite a few things in this one. This you can really make your own. You can do things like if you're thinking about like your future wedding or like kids names is that something that you guys talk about you can always add that in. I have songs I want to be played at my wedding because I'm a teenage girl and I always think about my future wedding and then I have just a plain letter and then I have a little quote on a note card that says one day we will never have to say goodbye only good night and I thought that was kind of cute so I wanted to add that in there too. The next one I have is when you miss me a lot. In this one I just have a cute little note for him to read. The next one I have is for when he's sad and this one makes me sad but I just gave him a letter with a list of things that I think would cheer him up. This next one was one of my original open ones that I did, and I am honestly still really proud of the, the design that I did. This one I also did find off of Pinterest, so I cannot take credit for it. For this one, I have a letter as well as I added in some little smiley stickers that I've had since forever and hope that it'll cheer him up when he sees them. The next one I have is for when you can't sleep, and this one I just wrote a letter. For the next one I have when you just need a hug, for this one, I wrote him a note as well as I made him this. This may sound stupid, but I think I'm funny sometimes, so I decided to add this in. When I was little for grandparents' day or mother's day or father's day or something, we made this, which is just like a cutout of your hands with like an accordion thing. It's for like giving yourself a hug. So I gave him this and you might think it's stupid, but I think I'm funny, so I added it in. And that just goes to show you don't have to just write a letter or do exactly what I'm doing. You can do literally whatever you want with these letters, be as creative as you like. The next one I have is when I just left after a visit. This one, you can honestly do like a part two, part three type thing. And for this one, I just wrote a little note and what else did I do in this one? This one I just wrote a note for, but you can honestly do whatever you want. The next one I did is Reasons We Are Meant To Be, and this one I wrote him a little note card, and on here I added a couple little stickers, 
and he is really loves penguins so I added a penguin sticker on here. For this one I just added in things that we have in common or things that we both love and just reasons I think we're meant to be. This one I realized after I made it I kind of made it the font of it kind of look creepy but it's okay I still like it this one I added in a whole bunch of just little note cards I wound up taking just a full-size note card folding it in half and then folding those two halves in half again to make it a fourth and then this I just added in um what he is to me so I added like he's my forever my world my anchor and then just a whole bunch of different note cards as you can see my boyfriend is absolutely obsessed with penguins. We even made a penguin short on it, which I will link in the description below if you want to go see it. But I decided to make an open one card, which I've never seen this done before. Probably not the first one to do it, but I think it's personally a really good idea. I did open one you want to know some random facts about penguins. Now, I know he probably knows most of these already, but I found some that he actually didn't know, and I really, really like this one. For this one, I just folded a note card in half, and I just wrote a whole bunch of different penguin facts on there. The next one I did, I don't know how I came up with the design, but I really, really like the design of this. I did for when you're stressed, and for this one, I wrote him a long letter and just to try and de-stress him, and then just gave him little suggestions so he's not stressed anymore. The next one I did, which he hasn't opened yet, and I hope he will never have to open, is when you're doubting us. That's all I'm gonna say. This next one, I accidentally drew on it with pen, so I tried to make it into a different type of design I'm really not proud of this one, at least the design of it, but I did when you need inspiration slash motivation. And again, for this one, I just wrote him a whole bunch of tiny little note cards, just giving him little inspiration if he is having like a rough day at school or little things like that. Again, this next one's kind of similar, but I put a little bit of a twist on it. I did when you need motivation to keep going, PS, you got this, I love you. And for this one, I wrote him an even longer letter and it's just for when you have those harder days that you just need a little something to get you through the day. Personally, I am obsessed with quotes about life and love and just getting through life in general. And I did open one when, when you want to hear some of my favorite quotes. And honestly, some of these are so good and I just had to share it with him. And I'm really proud of this open one card too. I really love the way this one turned out. The next one I did is when your tummy hurts. And this one I just did a letter for. My boyfriend and I started talking on December 31st of 2020, so I gave him this to open on December 1st of 2021, which I know was last year, but it's still part of this, so I gave it to him for him to open just for a yearly recap of all the memories we made together. The next one I did is open when it's February 14th. I actually kind of really like the way this one turned out too. I think it's a little bit different, and this one I just wrote him a letter for him to open this Valentine's Day. This next one I have is open when it's your 19th birthday. His 19th birthday has already passed, but I just wrote him a little letter in here for him to open. My boyfriend is now in his second year of college and I always used to make fun of him for being a freshman. So I did open when you've completed your freshman year in college. So this was just kind of a list of why I'm proud of him and things I want to do once he's done and just little things like that. The next one I did, which this one I really like, I did open when summer's around the corner and this was just kind of a whole bucket list of ideas that I wanted to do or just ideas that I wanted to turn into a bucket list for the summer of 2021 or no 2022 what year are we in yeah 2022 the next one I did is for a special surprise for this one I just have a little something which I won't say what it is but I have a little something just wrapped up in some tissue paper for him to open up either for Christmas or for our anniversary that's coming up the next one I have is open when you need to know how proud of you I am or how proud I am of you what how proud I am of you yes that's it. <laughs> for this one, I'm just going to have a whole bunch of different note cards. I haven't quite finished this one yet. I'm still in the process of it, but I'm going to write a whole bunch of little note cards just giving him different reasons why I'm proud of him. The next one has got to be one of my favorite designed ones. I really, I don't know. It just, I think it looks so sleek and I love the way this one looks. It's just open for a random letter just because. And for this one, I've just wrote him a random letter about just a whole bunch of different things that are on my mind that he'll be able to read someday. This next one I really, really love, and honestly it's taken up a lot of time, but I think it's going to be so worth it in the end. I did open when you want 
to remember memories of our second year together. I just have a whole bunch of different cards with the different months on it. Like for the first one, I have just January and I listed off just all the different things we did in that month. And I did the same thing for every month of the year. Obviously we're not all the way through the year, so I haven't quite finished this one yet, but I'm really excited to look back on this because we started dating in January. So I kind of just took that as the full year, but I just think it's a really cute idea and like to look back on all the different things we did and know which months we did it. I don't know. I really th I thought this was a cool idea. These next ones are kind of ones that categorize under more personal ones, if you get what I mean. This one is open when you want some coupons. So this, honestly, you can do whatever with. I have like, things like a movie night of your choice, have me pay for something because he never lets me pay for anything, and then you can kind of take it from there, wherever directions you want to take it. The next one is when you're feeling some type of way, you can really go any direction with this, but I'll leave that up to you. This next one I think is so funny. I looked up just a whole bunch of dirty pickup lines and I did an open when you need a good pickup line and I did like dirty edition and asterisks. That's quotations. You get the point. And some of these are absolutely hilarious, most of which I cannot probably say on YouTube. But I highly recommend doing this one. I think it's so funny. Going along with that, my boyfriend really loves watching the Sidemen. So I decided to make an open one letter for when you need some Sidemen pickup lines. And I for this one, I did episodes three and four. They have like a Sidemen Tinder and they have four different episodes for it. And some of them are so good. So I have them on just little half note cards and I have the quote and then I have which episode is from and then who said it. This one, I haven't really seen anything done. And again, like if your boyfriend or girlfriend doesn't watch Sidemen, probably doesn't make sense for you to do this one. Could be also be really funny still, but you can kind of take it in whatever direction you want. For this last one, I have reasons I find you hot slash cute, and I just have a whole bunch of these mini note cards again, just with a whole bunch of reasons. So those are all the open win letters that I've made so far. I know I'll be making more in the future, so maybe I'll have to do an updated video later on. Some other ideas that I have that I haven't quite done yet is doing some sort of song lyric one. Um, you can add in different song lyrics that relate to you or different songs that represent you guys. I think that would be kind of a cute idea. You can also do like a remember when open one card, if you know what I'm saying. You can do like remember when this happened or remember when we did this. like some sort of thing like that. You can do just another random letter. You can do honestly whatever you want to do. There's tons of ideas on print Pinterest. There's other ideas on YouTube and I'm sure you'll be able to find some. Even if you just do a couple, you don't have to do all the ones I did. I think it is such a great idea for, especially an anniversary. I think it is such a cute idea for anniversary. Hopefully this video was able to help you and I was able to give you some ideas. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye!